How are you doing? Um, I I for, I've forgotten how to intro, so this is what you're gonna get. Yeah, yeah. Um, but yes, today is a bit of a quicker video. Um, I wasn't planning to film this, but basically, there's a new beta kind of function in Star Stable, and I wanted to test it out with you guys, so see my reaction, give my opinions, and yeah, let's actually go check it out now. That must have been the shortest interest I've ever done, but. This new feature I'm talking about, basically, if you don't know, um, the in the game slash blog post thing, Star Stable told us about a new horse buying feature slash, slash horse bonding feature that they were planning to implement in the game. And uh, like in last week's update, it was said that they have implemented it for half the players in the game. So it's completely random it doesn't matter your country your region your server whatever it just it was just randomly given to half the players and i have been fortunate enough to have the update on my main account um this is what it looks like but no spoilers just yet because i actually I made a sort of overview video where I was just planning to put the text and stuff and like show you guys but I thought you know what I actually want to buy a horse with this feature and um, record it documented and tell you guys what I think because I have some different feedback to give but yeah that's the one I want is actually in your big stables so we're gonna head over there with the new free transport by the way I didn't make a video on the equestrian festival because I thought okay every single youtuber is probably gonna make an update video on it but you know I think it's pretty cool I think it's pretty fun but yeah that's my opinion on that but this is the horse I wanted to buy I am usually not the biggest fan of Palominos, at least not anymore, but this one, okay, this thoroughbred, this, just the coat and everything, I think it looks absolutely gorgeous, and um, I wasn't going to buy it seeing as I have like seven horses left to train, but you know, with this one, it's about to leave, and so I thought, why not, you know, why not, yeah, let's go over the actual horse buying window, first of all. So first of all, we have the generation up here, English thoroughbred, the breed, of course, the statistics, which I have no idea about, the restrictions, which are like level, reputation and stuff, change coat. Now, originally, I thought this was for like magical horses, so you could see both their coats, but what this really is, is um, I probably, I'll, I'll show you back in more, but it can change the coats available of that breed and since this is currently available only for the festival horses and there are no other English thoroughbreds in the festival you can't change it to a different coat let's change main um this is just like the main styles and you can't turn the horse or like zoom in or anything like that which um I can't I'm gonna be honest, I find that disappointing. I was really hoping we could just turn it around and like view it all three dimensional and all, but I guess not. Not not for now at least. Once again, this is still a work in progress and we don't know what's gonna happen. So the braid, the normal mane and all that, all that. I probably just gonna keep this mane because I don't really like the original mane the thoroughbreds come with usually, but uh, actually on on this one it seems pretty cool yeah this one i think the main's pretty cool on it but what what you can do is you can change main and then you can x out and you can see it with that main so if you do want to like see it properly you can just dismount and go ahead and check it out like on the actual horse because you know it does do that which is which is cool i guess but it's annoying to keep like switching in and out every time you change the main stuff and Again, I'm wondering if that's like an actual thing or they, it was kind of a, just a glitch, you know? Browse breeds and it's only the Arabian. And if you guys can see, it actually turned into the Arabian back here. So now there are two Arabians just waiting. <laughs> but yes, you can browse breeds and there's a wider selection if you like go to Merlin. So 
that's the description which pretty much won't change and then the animations which are idle walk trot i'm sure everyone's seen english terrible gates by now canter gallop fast gallop oh my gosh they don't like a spring um and that's it you can't see the rear the backup or the hard stop i don't think um i don't know about special moves though wait let me just see this one if you can see the special move oh yeah you can you can okay so you can't see special move but you can't see the rear the backup or the hard stop but we're gonna go to Moreland, and i'm gonna show you some of the things that i couldn't really show over here over here the buckskin and the illusion you know i thought this one was really pretty i still do but i don't really want to buy it anymore like i did back then um that might change though so you can change the main of course and then you can x out and there's the main right there and if you go to browse breeds you can actually choose from all these breeds so if i want the lusitano um the lusitano will be right here double lusitano now let's go see how it is and you actually want to buy the horse right we're back and i'm gonna try i'm gonna i'm not gonna try and buy i'm gonna buy the horse personalize and buy all right so okay we can change the age let's see i'm gonna make it an adult it just looks adult like to me and you know it can be um and it can be a mare why not okay now we can choose a name oh wait we can search wait 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 that's cool that's cool that oh okay i really like that um now what do i want i don't have an idea um can you randomize oh it, it brings you back here to randomize oh that's kind of annoying but okay um i had an idea for a name let me just see iron iron and then we can just do what we could do irony okay i really like that though wait but uh, this word doesn't look like an irony a few moments later you know what i'm gonna go with it i like it i like it <laughs> oh my gosh that was probably the quickest horse name I and if my voice sounds weird just know it was it's because i just had a cold um i'm over it now but I, I just had a cold and clearly you can still hear my voice and also i had really spicy pasta that uh, i made and it, and it didn't work out and I, and I had like trash the whole thing but that's another story <laughs> okay so that's gonna okay that is pretty much it and yes you can search the last name mm -hmm. as well and oh my gosh wait it starts glowing oh my gosh yes oh it's just so pretty this is where is this um it looks kind of like steve's but you don't see that many rocks at steve's oh my god look at the, the detail and the colors and oh my gosh it's just so pretty it's really pretty send to stable or ride now okay i can ride it now Ooh. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I just bought a new horse. That was the entire horse buying process and I'm just going to assume that they're gonna add like the horse bonding thing at the end there. Um, I could be wrong, I probably am wrong, Gotta, let's be honest here. But yes, that is pretty much it. And um, one thing, I don't have my tack anymore, so... Um, <laughs> um we're gonna have to go back and get some tack because i forgot to untack my other horse because i'm smart like that irony has her own stall i don't know who got kicked out to make way for her but um yeah, let me just get the tack off my old horse because i just made that off and i'm not bothered to make another one and now we're gonna go to the equestrian festival and do some races for some tokens get irony to a higher level i don't i don't know it's she's not the person training at the moment but you know since we just bought her and i'm gonna talk a bit more about this new feature all right as far as my opinion on this system goes uh first off and honestly foremost i wish we could zoom in and like turn the horse around so we're able to see it from like more than one angle um because if you were to buy the horse you would be seeing it from every angle especially for photographers um it really matters to, like with what the horse looks like from every angle and maybe you want to see it from the angle you're riding in or what it looks like 
like that. So it, I think it would be really helpful if they were if we were able like turn the camera and see the horse like from every direction. Second of all, I wish we could see the rest of the animations because, like I said, the jump, the hard stop, the rear, and the backup, I think, were not there. And, of course, we would like to see those animations, and I'm honestly not sure why they didn't include them. Um, maybe it's because like you have to buy the horse to see the rest of the animations, and it's like a preview, um, which... I mean, I, I don't I don't know why they would do that, honestly. But I think it'd be better if we were able to actually see the, every single animation from that horse. Yeah, honestly, I don't have that many criticisms to make of this system because I think it's honestly pretty good. I think it's much better than what we had before. And it makes me a lot more excited to buy horses now because we have this system. And... Okay, it's only for the festival horses right now, only for half the players, but they will be releasing it to every single player once they're done testing and developing and making their final changes. And yeah, that is pretty much all my opinions. I know it wasn't as much and I'm not as constructive or criticism. <laughs> I can talk, but um, I'm not as like criticized or I'm not as like, constructive as some of you guys might be so let me know in the comments down below what you think of this system everyone's opinions are valid um please don't go attack anyone for their opinion i would not appreciate that but yes that is pretty much it all right everyone that is pretty much it for this week not this week's video um but today's video and once again let me know what you guys think about this feature down in the comments below and yeah i hope if you guys enjoyed don't forget to leave a like subscribe for more content like this and i'll see you next time bye